Hi everyone, welcome back. It is officially the last day of the 12 days of quote unquote vlogmas and this is my what I got for Christmas video. Um, this Christmas was really special because I had been saving money to buy everyone's Christmas presents which is why some of them are super grand this year. Um, and that's not typical for me whatsoever. Um, so I can't wait to officially share uh, what I got everyone. If you watched my wrap with me, you got to look into some of them, but you did not get to see all of them because I did not want to risk my younger siblings knowing what their gifts were. But before I can tell everyone that, I have to tell you what I got for Christmas. And we're going to start with what the siblings got me. So my young sister, um, my family, we get Christmas PJs and my sister with her Christmas PJs got slippers, which meant I got my slippers that say read on them, um, that match with my freshman year roommate. I got those back and I was so happy. So that was my Christmas gift for my sister. Uh, brother number three got this cute little necklace for me. I love like the triangles. I don't have anything like this in my collection. It's got sparkles on it. It's, it's just, it's rose gold, which we know me with rose gold and glitter. I'm obsessed um, and I'm so thankful for that. He got it from the Sistema store. So I got that and I'm just so happy about it. Brother number two is my fashion brother and he is currently working on an outfit for me. So that was my Christmas present. It's not finished yet, but it's getting there. And as soon as it is finished, you guys will get to see it everywhere. I promise. Um, brother number one got me this cute little handbag. He also got this from the Sistema store, but I really like it. I love the fringe. I love um, that I wouldn't have necessarily chosen this for myself, but I feel like I can get a lot of use um, at like rodeos and concerts and just jazzing up a cute little outfit with this bag. So I'm excited. I'm so thankful for that. Um, For Christmas, um, We'll start with cute little things. Obviously, I got like regular chocolate. I'm a toffee person, so I got um, some English toffee from the co chocolate cottage in my stocking. But then I we also got these little like trivia card games in our stockings. And I, of course, being the sports admin major, got the sports trivia game. So that's super special. And then um, also got some pink because we know my favorite color, everybody. My favorite color is pink. Um, we got some Silly Putty, so I got pink Silly Putty in my stocking as well, besides all the chocolate. Um, so that was in the stocking. Um, the big ticket Christmas item, which usually our big ticket Christmas items come from Santa and Mrs. Claus. Um, my favorite musical of all time is Six the Musical. And they are coming to Utah. And opening night is <laughs> January 9th. Um, which is the day before classes start at Belmont. Um, but I was totally willing to miss the first day of classes if I could get to opening night of my favorite musical. And when I say favorite musical, I mean favorite musical. Like, I have a lot of musicals that I love, but this is my favorite musical. I think this is one of the only musicals where I know every single lyric to every single song. Um, and that is saying something. So I'm, I'm just super grateful. And brother number two is really into musicals as well. He was cast in our school's production of Aladdin for this year. And I'm excited to see what he does with that. Um, but he also asked for six the musical tickets. He wanted me, my mom, and him to go. And so my mom worked really, really hard. They were not letting the tickets out until like November. Like, and even when it was like November, they were like, my mom called up the ticket office and was like, is there any way to get three tickets to opening night? Like this is the situation. Um, and I even told my mom, I was like, I'm willing to miss the first week of school as long as I can see this musical. But I was praying that I wouldn't have to miss the first week of school. Um, and so lo and behold, my mom was able to get three tickets to opening night. And because of that, of course, we had to get some cute little shirts. So we got these matching t-shirts. 
um, it's got the crown, and then it says we're one of a kind, no category, and then six. Um, obviously, very shiny. I love the material that it's made out of. Um, and me, my brother, and my mom have these same t-shirts. So I'm so thankful for that. She got them custom made. And then we also got these cute little crowns. Like, oh, we know I'm obsessed with princesses, like, and queens. I love crowns and tiaras. So I have this one that I get to add to my collection. It's in gold. Um, my brother also got one, and then my mom got one in silver. Um, and we get to wear these to opening night. I feel like I'm, I'm just going to put this in my hair. We're going to keep it in the hair for the rest of the video, because why not? Um, I'm so excited about this. Like, you guys have no clue how excited I am about this. Like, this is truly something I can't wait for it. and I get to go see it in like two weeks um the other thing usually we'll get a clothing item and so sorry for the noise um I got this cute little plaid jacket um your girl loves her plaid and her flannels um I don't have a jacket and so I have this cute little jacket that I get to bring back to campus with me and I'm so excited. It's so soft and comfortable and I'm going to be getting a lot of good use out of it. Um, last item I got for Christmas was this massager. Um, I'm a violinist. I also sleep on my left side and so I get a lot of tension in my left shoulder neck area and I, I mean a lot of tension like you have to hold it before you like really hold and squeeze it before you can even start massaging it like that's how tense it is in my um, left shoulder neck area and that's just due to violin and me sleeping on that side um, and I, I complain about it a lot because it can bring me a lot of pain sometimes especially when it's cold outside. So, uh, we love that. But my mom took pity on me and got me a massager. So this will be coming with me everywhere I go. So as to help with my shoulder and neck problems, we're working on it, everybody, but it's, it's a work in progress. And I'm so glad that we have this massager. Um, that's everything that I got for Christmas. Now to tell everyone what I got my family for Christmas. Um, I will know I got some stuff for my grandparents, like, um, both sides of, both sets of grandparents get us ornaments every year. So I got two ornaments, um, ornament from dad's, um, family said Tennessee and all these different things that make Tennessee special. Um, the ornament that I got from my grandma and grandpa on my mom's side, um, was um, a Hallmark ornament. We know how I love Hallmark, everybody. We get Hallmark ornaments from that side of the family every single year. Um, and it's the like fiddler on the roof one. It's a reindeer playing the violin. It's really cute. I love it. I'm obsessed. Um, and I'm so glad I get to have that ornament. So I got those two ornaments. And then um, my mom's side of the family, those grandparents always get us books for Christmas. So I got a, a whole bunch of books. I have like six more books that I got to add to my bookshelf. Um, and that's so exciting. I can't wait to read all of those. And then my uncle Kelly on that side of the family got every single one of us kids huge tubs of popcorn, which is perfect because we love to watch movies and we've had a sibling sleepover like every single night um, during break. And so we've just been chowing down on our tubs of popcorn. So those were other things that I got from my not direct family. Um, for my direct family, Christmas presents that I got, and I will be linking what I can below. Um, I got my dad two tickets, um, one for me and him to go see the Utah Jazz play against the Mavericks on January 1st at 7 p.m. And I'm so excited. I have never been to an NBA game in my life, which is crazy considering I am a sports administration major. Um, 
but I am so excited and I got us matching Utah Jazz t-shirts and my dad is so particular about his hat like he's so particular about hats he does not like snap bags he does not like mesh bags like it has to be solid that, those are his favorite types of hats and I know that and so I went on the hunt for a Utah Jazz hat that he would love and I finally found one I was nervous because I could not see the back and so I was looking at the back and I was like please be the correct back like please back I got it it's correct so I will link it below if anyone else has a dad who does not like mesh bags or snap bags or anything like that that will be linked below so I'm so excited to be going with my dad to go see that my mom um her childhood favorites new kids on the block and Paul Abdul are coming to Utah three days after my 20th birthday so I got me and her tickets to go see them in concert and we're not sitting on the lawn at USANA, we're actually sitting in seats. So I'm so excited that I was able to get her that. Um, I also got her a little makeup pouch from Ken's Customs. I do have a discount code for anyone who wants to use that. It's just the Hannah Christensen um, and that can be found in my link tree um, if you ever decide to shop from Ken's Customs. But I did get her that mint green little makeup bag filled it with our um the bracelet that I showed you guys with our flowers and birthstones on it and then I also got her and me these matching knot rings I wear mine on my left middle finger um and so I love it she really likes it and all those things are linked below except for the tickets of course brother number one I got him a whole bunch of Belmont merch it was just stuff that I had gotten from games and of other events that I didn't necessarily want to keep in my wardrobe um, and so I gave him all of that Belmont merch and got some storage bins for him, one of which was the stuff that I put the merch in. Um, so I will link those um, bins below in case anyone wants them and I can't link the t-shirts because they were limited edition and stuff like that but I will link you the Bruin shop website in case you want to buy any Belmont Bruin gear if you're a Bruin. Um, brother number two, the fashion one, I got him a cute little bracelet where you can put pins on, um, and then some chalk for marking, um, patterns and stuff like that off of Amazon. And so those are linked below. Brother number two, three, I got him tickets to go see Niall Horan, um, in concert when he comes to Utah in July. And I'm so excited to see that concert. He's so excited to see that concert. I made up a cute little um, graphic announcing it to him and he freaked out. So I also got him some cute little merch off of Etsy, linked to that below. I also got myself a cute t-shirt. Um, it's not the same one, but I will link that below in case you want that one. Um, my sister, um, she's super special. I got her a purple makeup bag from Ken's Customs with her initials on it. Um, and then I got her some claw clips because um, she's obsessed with her claw clips. I got those um, from the wet brush website. Obviously I'm linking all this up below. And then I got her a cute little necklace that says her name and has her birthstone on it because all of my girls this year got something to do with their birthstones or birthstones and flowers in general um so that was kind of the theme for all my girls this year and my sister has been wearing that necklace nonstop, um and is so excited about the claw clips and it's just been so great it was so great to see everyone open their presents and I'm so glad that I can finally tell you what I got everyone so I'm so excited I get to go see that game with my dad I get to take my mom to see her childhood favorites um Three days after my 20th birthday, I get to take my brother to see Niall Horan and I get to go see Six the Musical. So 2024 is going to be so much fun and I can't wait to take you guys with me. I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. I can't wait to see you guys next time and have a wonderful rest of your day, night or whatever. Bye.